How's it going guys? This is Jack. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to a long long awaited new video from Green Hell. Now guys Green Hell was came out in early access about a year ago. Uh, they've been making a lot of improvements to it and I've been waiting to kind of see what they were going to come out with and they just dropped version 1.0 the official game is out this is out on xbox and ps4 obviously pc which is what i'm playing on today but guys we're gonna give it a try now because the official story mode is in the game which is cool because when i played it before i put out a few videos uh it wasn't any there was very little story you kind of got a basic setup of what was going on but this is the full thing I don't know why it says version 0.9. I don't know why. Uh, but let me check on that. And either way, we're going to get going, guys. Welcome to the channel. If you enjoy the video, be sure to hit that thumbs up and let's get started. So we're just going to go with the basic welcome to the jungle. Uh, none of this is none of the hard stuff seems right for me so yeah we're just gonna go with the basic welcome to the jungle now this game guys is quite hard at least when i played it before you can get all kinds of different different things can happen if you drink bad water you can actually start to turn insane like you hear you hear voices in your head and uh you can get you can get like parasites on you like like um leeches and like worms in your skin and stuff like this this is legit a legit jungle survival game which is pretty cool how how real it is and they've added a lot of animals there's a lot of uh water animals there's all kinds of stuff guys so this game is pretty cool loading screens taking a minute but here we go I think this first episode, by the way, is a lot of setup, so bear with me. We'll get into the game after we get through this initial stuff. Okay. I'm here. Hey! I made it! <laughs> is everything all right? Yeah! You can come up! Um, you do know you have the walkie-talkie, right? <laughs> nice. Check your radio. Okay. Hold T to use the walkie-talkie. Okay. You can come up. Just go ahead. Mm -hmm. I need to find something in in my backpack. Uh, okay. That's a little weird. Um, what exactly? The gear should already be at the camp. You will know when the time comes. Patience. Hmm. All right. Very well. You can catch up, I guess. The path leads through that canyon. Mm-hmm. I know. Okay. So, this should ba be a basic, like, tutorial, if I remember right. WASD to move, T for walkie-talkie. Oh, uh, have you tied down the boat? C. C. Jake. That's um, yes in Spanish. <laughs> I know this might sound stupid under the circumstances, um, but I am glad we came back here. Yeah, I feel you. The yeah, place is beautiful. Still. Oh. Still. Can. We can't forget what we came here for in the first place. I know. Ooh, but as soon iguana. as we're settled in, I am off to the Jabalhaka village. Look at this. Take that stick. And what if they will not speak to us? Come on, let's not get ahead of ourselves. You're a phenomenal interpreter. If anyone can communicate with them, it's you. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Good thing I have an anthropologist at hand, Dr. Higgins. Okay, I found the tent. Is everything all right? The camp looks impressive. They put up a tent for us. Looks like everything's ready. Soul Trail always delivers. At first glance, it looks like we have everything we might need. Perfecto. Perfecto. Day two. 
Perfecto, guys, means well, perfect in Spanish. That's everything. We're Just officially sure settled in. You know, you know what that. that means, don't you? I remember the agreement, but maybe you should. Maybe we should reconsider this. I'm not sure it's the best idea for you to visit them alone. Cariño, you know I have to do this. I don't know what Cariño it's the means. Only way to make them talk. Oh, don't worry. It'll be all right. Better pick up some wood. Let's have a romantic dinner. Romantic canned beans. <laughs> Use your imagination. Okay, choose a place for a small fire. Okay, look at all this stuff, guys. What's this? We got a note. The Lost Tribe. This is their land. The heritage. Their heritage as it has been for thousands of years. Whoever, everyone who comes here needs to respect this. Shabono. Must be that. That. Um, shelter. Hunters. It's been three years since we saw them last. They often react with fear to the unknown. It's crazy, but we really need their help. Our entire plan depends on it. Okay. Um. Oh, it's okay. Let's, let's kind of just check out a couple things. Rainforest mammals. Harmless. Behind all the danger, there's still so much beauty within this jungle. The capybara, which is like this little, um, rodent kind of thing. Armadillo and tapir is like a pig kind of thing. Many small mammals are a food source for the indigenous locals. Rich in proteins and fats, they're a great complement to fruits and vegetables. Okay. We don't need that. I hit quit. It's interesting. Quit actually gets you out of that. A dart frog. Don't touch it. This deadliest amphibian on the planet is completely harmless for the natives thanks to combo ritual. South American tribes catch a living frog to extract the poison. Then they puncture burned children. Burned children's skin with small doses of frog poison until they become immune to it. Okay, that's intense. The Yabawa Yabawaka? Living in the deep interior of the Amazon, the Yabawaka is one of about 80 lost tribes. Due to a fear of the modern and cruel world, they mostly remain isolated. Will they welcome us? They are the key and the only lead as to why we're here. All right. I think. Maybe that's not quite it. So the undergrowth, understory, canopy layer, emergent layer. Okay, we're good. Oh, we got some uh, uh, solar panels. Let's see. Hold C to open the wheel and select the notebook. Okay. Yeah, we just do that. And I think we can just start putting in sticks. Am I, is that what I'm supposed to do? Find a tool for cutting trees. Okay, get firewood. And I think. Honey, just I this stuff can't down. seem to find a bag or two. Are you sure you brought everything? Nope. Oh. Yeah, everything the porters left. Why? Is anything missing? I'm not sure yet, uh, but it feels that way. Okay. Weird. Okay. So you get this out little outline and then you just kind of hit E a bunch of times to, to kind of place stuff in there. Okay, so I need this small sticks. Where are they? There they go. One long stick. A big stick. Just drop that. Where are, oh, there we go. There's one, but where are the small sticks, man? Come on. Okay. Here, we'll do this one. Am I not hitting it? Yeah, I was hitting like something else. Okay. Amazing. Amazing tree. There we go. Okay, those are just regular sticks. Good, we need one more, which is there. 
we go. Looks like everything's ready. Mia, can you bring me a lighter? Um, remember when I mentioned we seemed to be lacking some equipment? <sighs> Don't tell me. Yeah, we have no fire. <sighs> Not a single lighter, nor box of matches. Uh, we, we ordered both. Did you check everywhere? I did. You need to do it the old-fashioned way. The old-fashioned well, way. Well, not the best start of the expedition. <laughs> um, new craft. So we hit C, go into here, hand drill. So, stick or plank and a small stick. Okay. Stick. We'll just grab all these sticks. Are there any more small sticks around? Oh, there we go. Okay, guys, so now here we are. You go in here. You have to get a plank. You hit craft. Then I think you come over here and you get a small stick. You set it there. And then you can cr hit craft. It tells you what you can craft up here. You hit craft that hand drill. Mm, I need to find something dry. Okay, so I got something dry. I actually have found a bird nest. So you can hit right and then you put this like right here next to that. Bitch! <laughs> there we go. You got yourself this, you come over here, and you hold the E looks like. There you go. Oh Mia! The fire is burning. Coming. Give me a minute. Perfect. How do you do it? Hmm? What? You seem so calm. I am calm. Why is she like... I don't know how to explain it, but... Flickering. Strangely, it feels safer here than there. Oh, I don't know. Jaguars, venomous spiders, and snakes. Let's not forget the scorpions. <laughs> Mere ant's bite hurts like hell. I am well aware of that. But still, we have a chance to achieve something. Make a difference. At home, all we could have done was be helpless and wait. I prefer the wilderness. Hmm. What was going on at home? Um, you're right. No, you're right. I'm optimistic. If we're gonna find answers, hell, it'll be here. This time, we need to pay attention to the slightest details. Last time, I must have missed something. Last time, you were only making general observations. This time, we have a specific goal. Nonetheless, I'm a bit worried about you meeting the Yabawaka. Everything will be fine. Yabawaka is such an awesome word. Alone. We already agreed that's the only way. Besides, they don't seem to like you. They don't seem to like outsiders. They shot arrows at a military chopper. Hard to blame them. <laughs> Since you published your book, they've been under siege by the media, scientists, doctors. The World Health Alliance established a medical camp and probably performed research, violating the tribe's taboos. But I will convince them. I have to. Day three. Hmm. Where's Mia? Search the tent. Can't pick up that candy bar or protein bar, whatever it is. Okay, so we got all this is pretty much the same. Audio recorder. Recording number one. So, I'm on the expedition with my wife Mia. Hey Mia. Hey Mia. Say hello. Oh. Hello. The tent is up, so we can start working right away. I'll focus on indexing new plant species, and Mia, can you explain what you're going to do? Uh, well, I'm going to meet the Jabahuaca tomorrow. I'm worried, you know. Of course you are, but I'm ready, don't you think? I believe so, but it's still dangerous. I know, honey. Don't worry. Okay, mm. that's all for now. It was... Mia? And Jake Higgins, day one. Okay. 
I don't know if there's anything else here. Oh, I didn't read this. Skull painted warriors. Mysterious painted warriors appeared yesterday on the riverbanks as we floated by. Who are they? Our friends, the Yabawaka, seem afraid to talk about them. Okay. Oh, a note? I'm at village. Call me with radio when you wake up. Yes, there's a little gift for you. Gift? Oh, is it this watch? Sweet. Let's see. Hello? Mia? Hey, sleepyhead. Finally up? Well, uh... Where are you? I should reach the village shortly. Remember, if you see a totem, do not go any farther. Those are clear warnings. I know, I know. I read your book. Well, <laughs> I was hoping we'd have breakfast together. You surprised me, that's all. <laughs> Admit it. You thought I forgot your birthday, didn't you? Well, I didn't. That must be this. Oh, look at that. I accidentally hit R. Hey, you gotta watch. Now, this watch gives us our vitals, like our nutrition, our water, all that. <sighs> exactly what I wanted. It even has solar batteries. And a macro element scanner. Check yourself to see if you're not missing any. We've been here only a few days. But stress can worry you out. Tell me about it. Hold F to look at your smartwatch and check the status of your basic needs. Okay, so... Water. It's probably fat, protein, and carbohydrates. Okay, so let's go over here. Grab this. Protein bar. Let's grab a few of them. Just because I can. May need them for later. Okay. Let's go to food. And let's right click and you hit eat. Two carbohydrates, 30 protein. Look at your smartwatch. Check the status. Okay. Good. Call Mia. Well rested and well fed. Keep it that way. We need that brain of yours working at peak performance. I'll try to take good care of it. Have you found them yet? See, si. and as expected, they don't want to talk. They behave as if I am not here. But they haven't driven you away. That's a good sign. You need to convince them that you're one of them. Mm-hmm, agreed. That seems to be the right course of action. I will sleep on the edge of the village and only eat what I can find. Just be careful, please. I will. But if I am to live like them, we can't be talking so often. You're right. They're suspicious of technology. If anything goes wrong, I'll leave the village and get you on the radio. Otherwise, you can assume everything is just fine and there is no need to worry. <sighs> All right. Let's focus on the goal. I'll be focusing on indexing new plant species. I think I saw a few new specimen around here. Check the cork board. Oh, right there. Tobacco plant leaves are great for healing venom bites, but what else can they heal? I saw this plant on the north side of the camp after climbing a rock. There are plenty of them. It's a good place to start. Okay, so let's go get that. The north side of camp. Uh, it's rainy outside, but that's okay. Um, north side. I don't know. I don't think this tells me north. It does not. But we'll go up here on this rock. Could be anywhere. Could be anywhere. Uh, huh. whoa. My sensitivity might be a little high. We'll just kind of look around. Go north. Is there... I don't think it tells you. Oh, scroll to change options. North. Perfect. I like it. I like it.
Um, must be up there. No space in backpack. Oh man. Must be up this way. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Up here? Maybe? No? Look around, we'll find it. Oh. Oh, here we go. Climb. Let's push up. Okay. Get up there, buddy. Here we go. Oh! Oh! oh. 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 Fuck me. Oh, no. Mia. I knew I was supposed to not call, but a line snapped and I fell down a good 30 feet. Yes, Mia, are, are you okay? Yes, Mia. I'm not sure. Hold on. I'll walk away a bit so they can't hear you. Let me know once you have checked yourself. Alright, let's see here. Hold C. Go to that little thing. Um, that's fine. With this arm. Oh. oh. That's definitely not good. New dialogue unlocked. Let's see here. Okay, I think we're good. We'll call Mia. Uh, it's it's all right. Nothing's broken. Just scratches and bruises. Nothing to worry about. In the jungle, every scratch can be dangerous. You need to patch everything up. Do you remember how to do it? Uh, let's just you know. I can't say that I remember. Look for Molineria. It has uh, long leaves without any markings and is surrounded by yellow flowers. Okay. Okay, I'll go look for it. Yellow flowers. You should have it in oh. your notepad. Call me when you've treated your wound. This looks like it, Roger guys. that. Over and out. <laughs> okay. Whoa. What's that? Okay, so let's check this. Molineria. Its long leaves are ideal for crafting bandages. Macros. Okay, here we go. The, these tell us our macros. Those drops are fats. The yellow is carbs, bread, protein. Perfect. Okay, cut down Molineria to get its leaves. Uh, so I probably need to get this guy. Clip it. I just pick it up. Okay, here we go. There we go. Okay. Oh, it already gave them all to me. Okay, so create a bandage. So you go into C. Go here. Um, here. Oh, I turn the page. Oh, look, guys. Okay, here's a bunch of stuff about sanity, abrasion. Okay, so there we go. So, create a bandage. So, I think we'll probably go like this and then craft a bandage. Like that. In fact, I may craft some more, but let's actually, let's actually fix ourselves. Open up inspection. And, and, oh wait, and the backpack. And then you just drag it over here like that. There we go. Easy peasy. So you have to go inspection first. But we should go ahead and just craft more of these bandages. While we're at it because... There we go. So we got a couple extra bandages, which is nice. Now let's call Mia. Here I am. All wrapped up nicely. Mm. Does it hurt? Um, yes, it does. Uh, like hell. Oh. Pobrecito mio. Imagine I am Pobrecito. hugging you now. Mm-hmm. 
All right, these two uh, are a little a cheesy. A bit better. Yes. So, how are you doing? I'll be initiated in a few days. I am optimistic. I expect to be treated as one of their own after that. And I should be able to ask some questions then. Some elders are opposed to this, though. Luckily, Chief Queenie is on my side. Chief Queenie. Why are they opposed? I think... I think they were divided even before I joined them. The Chief wanted to approach the World Health Alliance peacefully, but a few of the elders insisted on fighting. Now, the Jabahuaca basically have two factions. Sounds dangerous, Mia. Be careful. I'm not in any danger. Told you, I'm optimistic. Okay. Oh, I didn't get Jake, it. Jake, day thirty-two. Come in, Jake. I need you here. <laughs> Jake, please, please answer me. Mia, what happened? Mia, speak to me. Mia! Oh my god. What the hell's going on over there? Find Mia. Okay, guys. I think this is a perfect stopping point. Thanks for joining me. If you enjoyed the episode, be sure to hit that thumbs up. In the next episode, we're going to go find Mia. And we are going to find out what's going on. Like, this is all new to me. Of course, like the story's new, so this is, I don't know where we're going, so this is going to be exciting. Thanks a lot for watching, guys, and if you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit that thumbs up. Uh, and we'll join you next time. Bye-bye.